All right, with Junior today, class of 2022, Bishop Alamany linebacker, the man, four star at Notre Dame commit. How are you doing today, sir? I'm doing great. Awesome. All right, so it's been a little while. I'm excited to catch up with you. Let's dive right in. 2020 season, how did you feel it went? Uh, I mean, we had a, a couple ups and downs, uh, lost some players, but uh, we, we were able to manage to uh, pull, uh, bring some sophomores, freshmen to fill in those positions. So um, uh, either way, it was, it was still a great season. Uh, we went 4-1, uh, won our last game, so it went great. So you're that, that tough, hard-nosed, I'm trying to use nice words, <laughs> linebacker in the box. Um, so what are some of the, I mean, are you guys running a 4-2? What, what, what is the base? Um, I mean, this past season, we, we mixed it with a 3-4, 4-3. Um, but uh, this uh, past season, I was playing some outside linebacker uh, just to uh, just catch the feeling of, uh, you know, playing uh, out of uh, position. So uh, it was a little different, but um, it was something new for me to uh, get used to, but managed to get through it. But uh, last game, I was able to go back into the box and play great for the last game. So, yeah. so getting that expanding yourself getting that versatile role at outside linebacker what was how did your your game grow I mean what how did it expand um, I mean I learned uh, I mean I learned a lot um, definitely uh, different things uh, visually uh, uh, different aspects of playing inside linebacker and outside linebacker uh, outside linebacker uh, you got to pace yourself of uh, reading uh, from tackle to uh, number two receiver uh, inside the box is different you get get your read and go downhill and get that tackle so uh, it's a little different, um, but I was able to manage to uh, just play through it. So yeah. Awesome. So this off season, what are you working on with your game? Uh, this off season, I'm definitely working on agility and changing direction. Um, so that's the main thing. So we had uh, off camera a discussion about how tall you were, <laughs> but we can't debate the the weight room and you're tearing it up in the weight room what are some of the maxes for you uh i mean uh bench uh bench press 325 uh squat 500 uh, uh probably 200, so, yeah. that's awesome that's really good all right so let's get down to the nitty-gritty let's get into recruiting um so as mentioned you're a notre dame commit be the millionth person to congratulate you on that yeah, thank you. yeah so what was that that fit that feel for notre dame for you made it your ideal uh, I mean, it was it was the whole coaching staff, uh, especially Coach Freeman. Uh, great, great, surreal person. Um, but once I got into, onto campus, it was the it was the main deal for me to see myself going there. So, so yeah, it's a great school, right? Yeah. For sure. um, so uh, during that visit, what all did you see? What all did you do? Um, I mean, I got to uh, I mean, see, see finally see the coaches. Uh, definitely meet some players on the team. Uh, definitely get a tour around the campus, see myself uh, being there, and then as well as uh, um, seeing the field and everything. So, so yeah. Very cool. Uh, so just throwing a curveball here, do you think you might get to go to a game this uh, this fall? Oh, yeah. I'm planning to go to the USC versus the Notre Dame game. So. Oh, there you go. All right. Um, and then so I know you guys help recruit other top players to join each other. Um, so I'm assuming you are. Yeah. What's your pitch? What are you telling the guys? Why, why Notre Dame? It's the best of both, world, both worlds. Uh, I mean, you can't get anything better than education, uh, the network after football, and being being able to compete for that national championship. So, so yeah. That's awesome. Junior, appreciate your time today. As always, keep up the hard work, my man. Thank you. Thank you.